What's going on, you guys? This is Andrew Roboto, 2021 here, and welcome back to Five Nights of Warriors McDonald's 3, where we will be taking on part four of the custom night mode in the hallway, as well as the play place. Now, before I get started, um, I just want to take the time to say that um, today is March 4th, and on this day, I made my YouTube channel, and today I am celebrating my 10-year anniversary, which, believe it or not, I've been on YouTube making videos for 10 years, which is just crazy. I did not think I would make it this far, in all honesty, especially after my channel, my original channel, was hacked in, hacked in June 2015, but yeah, I mean, it's, it's crazy that I've made it this far, 10 years. But anyways, um, I just want to thank all of you for your support. Watch, thank you for sub so much for subscribing, as as well as viewing my videos, leaving a like and a comment. Your support is all appreciated. So yeah, just thought I'd take the time to thank you guys and acknowledge my 10 year anniversary, which is today, of course. Now, I'm trying to think what else I'm going to say. Oh, yes. And it was on this day I made... If you're wondering how I made my original YouTube channel, I made my original YouTube channel while I was at a Bruins game on this day, March 4th, 2014. March 4th, 2014, which is the day I made my YouTube channel. I made it while I was at a Bruins game, and I started uploading videos ever since. So yeah, just thought I'd give an origin of how um, I made my YouTube channel. And it was in June 2015, my channel, my original channel was hacked, and I did not make a new channel, which is the current one I have, until January 2016. And I had only been on YouTube for a year by then. But once I made a new channel in January 2016, I didn't stop there so yeah but anyways without further ado the first room we're going to do is the hallway which for the hallway we will be dealing with Wario, Waluigi, and Ashley. <clears throat> to set them to their levels. I'm sorry that's a little too loud I didn't mean to do that. Alright the hallway. So that's for a new we'll take on the first room for part four, which is the hallway, and let's see what has to offer for us. Gonna listen to the phone call since I haven't done this room yet. <laughs> and it's Richard McCroy. Hello there, Edward. What the fuck? Who are you? You don't need to know that. What you need to know is, thank you for coming back again. What the hell? Do you not remember what you did to us? What did you do to Max? Oh, you little buddy Max. I was just going to go over to where he is to give him a little present for making fun with you last longer. Don't you dare. Oh, yes. If you want to save him, then give up searching for the money. No. The choice is yours. No. <laughs> Wait, Edward, it's me, Max. Sorry, I was just hearing things. Oh, are you okay? I'm fine. I'm getting worried, Edward. I feel like you are searching all of this for nothing. Been looking everywhere for days. Now calm down, I'll be fine, okay? Okay, but where are you at? Uh. Where? In. In the hallway. The, the, what? The hallway? Look, look, I lost track of time and I couldn't find a room to stay in. God damn it, well, what can you do? I have a gun, a grenade, and a. A gun? How many bullets? Okay, and how packed are you with grenades? Yes, I have like 25 grenades. Okay, I have an idea. Alright. So, if someone is behind you, like your cameras, if you see them soon about to come in next to your room, then toss the grenade behind you to stop them. Uh, okay. And if someone appears in front of you, then try to shoot them. Uh, okay. Yeah, so use the cameras to track if someone is behind 
behind you and toss the grenade and if someone leaves in front of you then get ready to shoot them Oh, it's gonna be fun, uh, trust I me. I wouldn't get your hopes up, not to mention... This is they, another they fun room I'm gonna do. Fast. Listen, I can get through this, just gotta be ready immediately. Okay then, but look, just please come back home. It's not worth looking anymore if you still haven't found it. Maybe, I'll see. Okay, good night. Good night. Alright, this is gonna be another fun room to do. This time we get to toss grenades and shoot our gun. And use our gun. So for anyone who approaches behind us, which I assume is going to be from... Whoa! Okay, I wasn't prepared for them. Okay, you didn't shoot Ashley when she was running in front of you. Okay, so for Ashley, we have to shoot at her when she runs in front of us. Alright, got it. So we gotta be very quick about Wario, Waluigi, and Ashley. Okay, so I wonder how we're gonna deal with Ashley. I mean, Wario and Waluigi. But for Ashley, we have to shoot the gun at her when she is running. And then we have. And then for anyone we see on the camera behind us. Oops, hang on. Okay. Okay, so Wario, he works the same as Ashley. We have to... Wario, same mechanic as Ashley. We have to shoot the gun at him. And then I assume Waluigi will be coming from behind. And we have to throw a grenade at him. Alright. So I figured out how to deal with Wario and Ashley. Now I gotta figure out how to deal with Waluigi. Cause Wario and Ashley, we have to fire a gun at them. And then we have grenades to throw for anyone who comes from behind. Oh, oh okay. Okay, so when Waluigi is on cam 4, we have to throw the grenade. My god. My god. Max was right. Wario, Waluigi, and Ashley are running really fast. Jesus, they're moving. I didn't even set them on that high of wobbles. I didn't even set them that high, and they're still moving really fast. Because apparently Wario and Ashley run. Waluigi just, just comes up out of nowhere. So for Waluigi, we have to check Cam 4, and if he's there, then we have to throw the grenade to stop him. Then we have to throw a grenade at him. And then for, and then for Wario and Ashley, we have to fire the gun like I just did. Yeah, that's right. You stay away from me, Wario and Ashley. I don't need you... I don't need you charging at me like crazy. Okay, so this is going to be an intense night. Definitely... Okay, this is, a, this is a fun but intense night because not only do we have to fire a gun, but also throw grenades. Okay, I threw a grenade at Waluigi, so he left. So that's good. So really the only camera we got to focus on is Cam 4 for Waluigi. Because for Wario and Ashley, we have to fire the gun at them because we... Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. I didn't get to Waluigi in time. Oh, my God. Okay, this... For the hallway, it requires quick thinking because it's a very fast pace to not... The room is a very fast pace. Okay, so gotta be quick for Wario, Waluigi, and Ashley.
Jesus, and I'm surprised Wario can even run that fast, despite the fact he's he's chubby. Okay, for for a fat guy like Wario, he can run pretty fast in this game. He should he shouldn't even be able to run that fast. He's so fat. I mean, Waluigi and Ashley, I know why I can run really fast. But Wario? Okay. There we go. God, I gotta be very quick this night. Jesus. This night is definitely in both intense. This night is definitely very intense. It's also very stressful. Jesus, okay. It's very, very intense and stressful. Jesus. Okay. Jesus, why does Wario have to run so fast? He's, he's kind of fat, you know. Waluigi doesn't even run him this night. He just levitates. Jesus. Be gone, Wario, Ashley, and Waluigi. Be gone. In fact, Wario and Waluigi, Wario and Ashley move a lot faster than Waluigi. Nope! Okay, phew. Jesus, Wario almost killed me. God. They run so fast that they could kill me in almost instantly. Nope. Stay away from me. Okay. Ah! Okay. Thank you for letting me check the camera for Waluigi, Wario, and Ashley. Because I got to be very quick because I got to be dealing with two runners. Two runners and then a levitator. This reminds me of Night 6 and Find Out the Smarters 4. We have to fire a gun at um, Ratchet. At um, Ratchet in Night 6. Okay, yeah, I got triple team there. I was expecting that because they move so fast. Yeah, I was expecting the double and triple teaming because they move so fast. Jesus. Alright, Waluigi. Got rid of him. Oh my god. They move way too fast in this room. I mean, I... Jesus. What kind of drugs are these characters on in this room? Jesus. Ah! Jesus, you run as fast as... All three... Wario, Waluigi, and Ashley run twice as fast as... As Foxy does. As well as Tails and Final Fantasy Sonic 1. Jesus, you run just as fast as they do. Okay. Ah! Get away! Get away from me! It's a good thing I have plenty of bullets and grenades to, to fend these guys off. Okay, Waluigi. There you go. Oh my god, I forgot, I for, oh my god. I forgot to check for Waluigi, Jesus. Jesus, you didn't give me time to check for Waluigi. Jesus. God, you gotta, you gotta react very quickly in the hallway. This is definitely a hard room, one of the hardest rooms to deal with. In fact, the hallway along with the play area and the boys' bathroom are the hardest rooms in the game. 
Actually, I take that back. The hardest rooms in the game to do are definitely the hallway and the play area. Because the play area, you're dealing with all the characters at once. And then for the hallway, you got Wario, Waluigi, and Ashley who run very fast. Yeah, trust me. The hallway and the play area are definitely the hardest rooms in the game. Which is why I actually had a change of thought. I'm going to I'm going to be doing the play area in part 5. I'm going to be doing a part 5 for the custom I mode which will be the play area because both the play area and the hallway. Ah! Both the Can I have the floor please? Thank you. Okay, so the both, because both the play area and the hallway are the hardest rooms in the game, I'm going to be doing them separately. Like, the hallway will be for part four, play area for part five. Because these two... Yeah. Because these two are both the hardest rooms in the game. It's very intense and stressful. Okay. Got rid of Ashley. Check it for... Waluigi and Wario! Jesus. Okay, I, I thought I didn't get rid of Ashley because I put the camera up right before I shot the gun. But thank God I got rid of her. God, there's so many close calls in this night. Okay. It's doing so well. I've, hopefully I can beat this room because I was doing so well a little bit earlier until I until I got killed by Wall Luigi because I forgot to check on him. Cause you gotta move so you gotta be very quick this night. Okay, Wall Luigi. Yep, there you go. Got him. Ashley and then Wario's up next. Okay. They changed their patterns though. Wario and Ashley changed their patterns. Like, sometimes Wario comes first, then Ashley, or it's the other way around. And then Waluigi doesn't usually change his patterns. For Waluigi, he's usually the last one to come. After Wario or Ashley come in. Then it's Waluigi. Because Waluigi moves a little bit slower than Wario and Ashley. There we go. Got rid of all three of them. I was expecting the triple teaming as well as double teaming because 
Very intense. This room's very intense. Okay. Okay, ready? There we go. Got rid of them both. Okay, Waluigi, there you go. Got rid of him. All right, and we've beaten the hallway. Whew, that was stressful. Very stressful and intense. Oh, my God. This is just as hard, stressful, and intense as is the play area. My God. Okay, but anyways, um... We will take on the play area in part five of the custom night mode. Thank you for watching, everybody. Please hit the like button, also comment, and subscribe. I appreciate all the support you have all given me. Both, both this year as well as the past, pretty much in the 10 year. What I meant to say is pretty much thank you for all of your support you have all given me in the 10 years that I've been on YouTube. I really appreciate it. Be sure to hit the like button as well as subscribe and comment on my videos. I appreciate all of your support. Hit the bell to receive all notifications of upcoming videos on my channel. Be sure to follow me on TikTok as well as hit the bell to receive all notifications of upcoming videos on there as well. I once again thank you all for your support in my 10 years on YouTube. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.